Donuts. Whoa. Peter brought these home from his last week of work celebration. And I made a feast for us. We haven't had pasta and just our family red sauce in super long. Okay, so, okay, okay, eat up. Okay. okay, the thing is, is the whole Mediterranean diet and everything, we've been good and not good, but good too. And one of the things we've been really good at is not eating as much red meat. Or pasta. Or pasta at all. So like, we haven't had homemade ronies. Yeah, we call them ronies. Yeah, it's pasta and red sauce. It's but like, like macaroni. Sarah makes it all good, authentic, like, like, it's been cooking simmers. since 1 a.m. Right. or 1 p.m. It's been simmering for almost five hours, so it's... And, and I, here she comes! Here I she kinda, comes! I kind of got a headache starting. Oh, man. Maybe the food help. Yeah. just want to give a shout-out to our friend Maria. She, you, you're the best, but you really don't have to. But thanks for hooking us up with some more Beverly. I actually just confirmed with my buddy Sean, who we went to Wilderness Lodge with, uh, last... Was that last week? Last week, we're going to HHM tomorrow. I'm meeting him and maybe some other friends, but I don't want to say who because I don't know if it's confirmed yet. This Beverly looks different. It looks more like a cola. I'm kind of nervous. Oh, look at her. <laughs> Eating her donut king <laughs> with her curly hair. Does the can look the same? It's a little different. See, this is called like Chino con Chinota di Cecilia. That's good. I took uh, four Spanish, Italian classes and four Spanish classes in college, and I know uh, Mi Piace. But she was just making fun of me, calling me four eyes. After thoughtful consideration, we're going to the mall. <laughs> okay, I didn't bring a hat. Do you want to run in? He went back for the hat. First stop is Best Buy. We're gonna see if the camera we've been eyeing is here because we want to get our hands on it before we make the commitment. So we won't do our Robin Sparkles Let's Go to the Mall segment yes. now. Yeah, we will in a minute because... The sky is half freaky. What's that, what's, <laughs> what's that guy from Family Guy? It's all right. It's all right. I don't know. I've never watched a single episode of Family Guy in my life. Oh, on the video. <laughs> it's all right. Here's the future of the Brookhart project right here. A Canon EOS M50. This is the this is how like the most standard kit it comes with with the kit lens of 15 to 45 mil, millimeter. I think we're gonna get this with a shotgun mic on top. Right there. It's gonna get fancy on us right here. So you got a sideways flip out screen. And that's how it look. Not too big, really good, powerful, does 1080. Does 4K, but we would only use that for sit downs. Can you take the camera? Mm -hmm. I want to show this. This is the thing that gets me most excited. Is it flips? So it can be like this, or if we're like on Pride Secure No lights. So you're not making sure a, big, a big, a big so we're not light. Ruining everyone else's ride with the light from the camera, but we're still vlogging. But it's pretty. Do you like it? Mm -hmm. It's nice. It's like in between what we have and like one of these monsters. What's nice is like when we get it, I haven't, well don't look at them, but like we're gonna get the shotgun mic's gonna add a little size to, we're gonna get a micro one I think, so it'll be like a puff, like that big. Probably it will be on a stick or, or a gorilla pod more often than not, just because of the wide angle, because of the crop from the, the chip in there, but this is it I think, I think this is the winner. Look at this bed that we're gonna try to mimic one day. Crazy, this bed, like, it's like four quilts. There's that one, there's that one. Because when we go back to Chicago and we vlog and we're not doing stuff for holidays, like this is what the vlog's gonna be because this is honestly, <laughs> oh, look at this bed frame. This is what we need. That iron bed frame. 
But this is what Sarah and I did when we lived in Chicago, especially in downtown Chicago. We're like, what should we do on a Tuesday night? Let's go to Macy's on we State Street. We realized that Peter hasn't been to a mall since, <laughs> since we, we moved here. here. I mean, I've been to the mall in Chicago during visits home once yeah. or twice. But since we moved to Florida, I have not been to Mall Millennia since 2011 during Christmas time. And I've only been once. So we actually only have, we should get in the mall. Yeah. We only have 30 minutes to be in the mall. Yeah. Um. What? They don't quite make the uh, malls like this in Chicago. I mean, they make they make really good malls in Chicago. Just not. This reminds me of like O'Hare Airport with the glass ceiling and the tubular literally minus the palm trees. Cue the Robin Sparkles montage. So Peter worked at an eye fix and repair in Chicago. And it was shady. And it was like started the here. The guy knows the owner. He was the region manager of Chicago. His wife still works at the Florida Mall, I think. <laughs> Good old days. No Disney store. What's up also, with that? Also, he didn't work never... there very long after it was super shady. I was there like three months and it was like as short amount of time as I could And then you started working at the Disney store. And literally the guy was like, on my last day, I was like, I really like choosing work, but why didn't you like working? I was just curious. And I was like, because there's absolutely no rules, no structure, <laughs> and you guys do kind of some shady things. And he's like, fair enough. <laughs> We're ready to go home. Oh, well, downtown. We are downtown. Downtown. I don't know what we're doing downtown. 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 We're downtown. 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 <laughs> downtown. You don't want no people. So bizarre to us. There's like suburban blocks, but it's like downtowns right here. We might have to live down here. I don't know. I'm torn between this and, and Celebration Florida. I know, like, I would really like being close to the city. And it's still close to Disney. But I have four, sir. But, but it's like we're right, YouTubers. Right to, but right next to Yake, Lake Eola. What are you saying about the YouTubers? Like, we wouldn't be getting on the road at your, ta your typical time. True, and we always wanted to be city downtown vloggers, too. There's a subway. We could live right by a subway. I wish there was a subway here, like a an underground public transportation. There's water down there. Wow. It's gorgeous. I don't see. You think you're doing it, Orlando? It's also singing Yankee Doodle Dandy down there. often all lit up and purdy. I'm making secret Christmas hot cocoa. Someone's excited that we're home. I'm very tired. I fell asleep while Sarah made hot chocolate. We're gonna sign off now because we had a long day. I got up real early because I had to go to work early because it being my last week I had to like, uh, I've been working for the past week to like get everything set so the team I'm on is set up for success going forward. This is uh, hashtag sponsored by Upcut35. And Christmas. And Christmas. Um, but since I'm a senior data analyst, I had I had like a bunch of responsibilities. That, like I was like staging, setting up, and like helping get ready for them to go on to somebody else because I'm not going to be doing that next week. So my work is kind of like winded down now. Like I don't have too much to do the next three days, which will be nice. Um, but look at this cool book we got in the mail from my friends Steve and Leah. An A to Z of coffee from grinding and roasting to brewing and tasting. The coffee dictionary. I'm super excited because it's like fancy looking and it's coffee related and it's like the perfect like 
It can go on display in our kitchen. It can go on display in the kitchen. It can go on a coffee table. It can go on a bookshelf. It can teach me all the good stuff. Reverse osmosis. I don't know about that stuff. Things about strength. And it's got some artsy fartsiness to it. So thank you so much. You are way too kind. Here is the ultimate... Arabic to Zambia guide to all things coffee. Ooh. Maybe I'll get a pour over or something to go next to this and look all artsy fartsy. Even in between us. Ooh, it smells like Christmas time. Oh boy. Let's see if she's gonna come over here. Come here. Come here. Thanks. It was a fun night. Walking around, driving around, doing what we do best. Exploring our city. We're getting there. We're learning more and more about it every day. Yeah, it's funny. We like went down with like no like intention of where we were going downtown. We're like, we don't know where we're going. Yeah. It's not like Chicago. We're like, we're going downtown. We have no plans. <laughs> and we can like come up with some. It's funny. We passed by an insomnia cookie. And then like 10 minutes later, we saw on... Instagram? Or no, on Sheikah's Facebook. On Sheikah's Facebook. That's Sean and, and Sheikah. Were there. I even thought of like, should we pull over and like go see how much like one or two cookies are? But we had the Donut King, so we already had way too many sweets as it was. Um, but that would have been so funny if we would actually would have stopped. Yeah. I had the thought too. I was like, should we just stop? <laughs> but it's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.